Hi and welcome to my channel. It's me, Tina. I am here with an AliExpress haul. Um, I will get started right away. I have quite a few things here. So, um, this is a phone case that I got. And I love it because I love these little girls, as you probably all know. And this is the iPhone 10 X I believe that's what I have so I got that and it took a long long time to get here let me just say that I'm not sure if it was because of the pandemic but it took a very long time and yeah it's just a plastic one now she's so cute and I love to have like a ring on my phone. Where is my phone anyway? Um, so I don't know if I'm going to put it on here, but um, I also got this this case and it has the um, it has water in here and uh, the little glitter flows black back and forth. This is a really tough, tough case. Um, it, my phone has fallen many times and it's really protected it. This looks like a much, uh, flimsier case. So yeah, I'm going to have to be a lot more careful than with this one. So we'll see. We'll see if I put it on here. And also I wouldn't want to put a little ring on here. And I love my little ring like this. So we shall see what I do. Maybe, you know, just once in a while I'll put it on. But she is so cute. I love it. And uh, then another household item I got is this really cool um, thing. It is to hook onto your vacuum cleaner. Um, they give you these attachments. But these are little straws at the end. And it's like, say you want to vacuum out, you know, like the bottom of a drawer. And, you know, you don't want to suck anything. Uh, like, say there's a coin in there, you know. You don't want to suck that into your vacuum cleaner. So you can just kind of go like this. And, uh, yeah, hook that onto your vacuum. And it will work really well. So I got this. I really, really like this. I want to uh, do some deep cleaning. I don't know what this is really for. Maybe it's, I don't know, to put on here. And then this has a bigger hole to put on a vacuum. And then you put this on. Not quite sure. But anyway... I have had this on my vacuum and it works and it is pretty cool so that is that and then this um, is a instead of using like a, what do they call it a steel wool on your pots and pans you can use this and it's not supposed to scratch them so I don't know if it will. I just seen it on there on AliExpress and I just thought I would try it. Um, this doesn't get uh, stuff stuck in there like um, you know like say you're doing like dough and uh, the dough doesn't get stuck in here you can just wash it out. So yeah <laughs> this is really cool. I have not tried this yet. Um, I will, if it, if it's garbage, I will let you know. Um, yeah, I am honest about if I do a review, um, about this. It comes with this little thing here to hang it up to air dry. So, yeah, that's what that is. <laughs> I just figured I would give that a try. And then, to go along with this one, I got... I saw they had these earrings, so I'm like, oh my goodness, they are so darn cute. And again, 
They took a long, long time to come. And I actually ha was disputing them. And uh, I put in a dispute. And then I talked to the... Uh, first of all, I talked to the seller. And he didn't respond, or they didn't respond. Then um, I put in a dispute. And uh, they told me they would resend them. So they resent them. And uh, then I canceled my dispute. And because I really wanted these. I didn't want my money back. And these are plastic backing, I think. And they are just so adorable. I just love them. I don't know if I'll wear them, but I just wanted them. Maybe for crafting. I don't know. We'll see. But I just wanted them. They're so cute. They're the little blue girl with the umbrella. And then um, I will go into, well, here's another little thing that I got. But this I was kind of, um, I don't know, miffed about. And it's totally my fault because I didn't look at the measurements. Um, these are little, I thought they were pocket knives. They are pocket knives, but look at the size. They are more like a charm. But they have a little knife and it is sharp. So this is this one. This one says love. And then there's this one with the like pearl handle all fancy I thought it was like legit big pocket knife but when I go back and see what it is it it says it is a charm and yeah so that's what that is and but they do cut like if you needed to cut something it actually it actually does cut like see what I mean it it cuts so if you had it on your keychain or whatever and you needed to cut a rope or whatever you could you could use that <laughs> they're so cute but I think they were like three dollars each so yeah an expensive charm but my son said he wanted one on his keychain and uh, I'll give one to my husband and then I got a, quite a few of these book corners that I'm always using. Let me see, was it three or I think three packages? Um, these are the gold color. And then I had the silver. I believe these are silver, yep. Okay, come on. And then I think the other ones were called gunmetal. And they're not black, but they call it gunmetal color. They're not brown, I mean. It's called gunmetal. So there you can kind of see the three colors that I have there. So I really like all three of the colors. They look really nice. They're different ones than, than I have. And I always love having, you know, all kinds of different stuff on hand. So that's that one. And then I got some beads. And these took quite a long time to come to. Um, these ones are, they're like a metal... Uh, mesh kind of bead. They're really light. They're very pretty. They just want to roll off of here. I don't know if you can see on here. They're silver. They're really cute. Very nice and shiny. And I just love those. So those are them. And then I got these um little ones that have the little diamonds on them and th this was just the multi-color one there's pink and silver and blue and oh look at this blue it's on black and then it has has blue on it very nice colors i love this Ooh, 
Oh, there they go. This is a multicolor one. That's like a brown. And there's a pink with crystals. And here's like a black. I love those. And here's just a silver. So those are pretty. And then I have these ones. Um, I forget what these are called, but I got these for the pens that I make. And um, they're the ones with the bigger holes. This is this one's got like a crackle in it. And I just got that sorted again. This one's a red, a pink, and this is like a brown or an ivory. Yeah, so different colors there. Oh, here's blue and... Here is a purple. So those are cute. I like all those colors. So that will be added to my bead collection. And then um, I got this uh, ribbon. It says handmade on it. And I believe there's five yards and um i think i got some of this not exact same kind from um uh and when we did our journal exchange her her channel name is uh oh my gosh okay i will put link that channel below but this says handmade and then it has a little present and this one has a teapot and some thread and a ladybug and a heart and yeah and then it just uh, starts over so I think there's supposed to be five yards of that in there and then I got well first of all I ordered these ones um, these uh, Stamps. I wanted the numbers because I see everyone using the like the N zero and then like with the numbers. So I wanted that. And these were cheap. I think they were like two something. So I was happy with those, but they wouldn't come and wouldn't come. So then I put in an an order for these ones, and these are uh, wood mounted. These are wooden stamps, uh, seal group it says, and these are really nice. I wanted these, but I'm like, I don't want to pay the price. So, um, finally, these just wouldn't come. So, I ordered these ones, and these are really, really nice too. I'm happy I have both. I've used these ones. I haven't... I think I've used one of these. Did I use one of them? I'm not even sure if I've used one of them. I thought I had, but maybe not. Anyway, they come in this nice box. You can just store them, and um, I usually just store them right here so they're ready to go at any moment. And yeah, so I have those. Then I also got this uh, music. Uh, stamp this musical note stamp and I really like it because you can just you know dip it and then you know stamp it anywhere or you can use like the whole thing so yeah this comes in very handy I love that stamp I never even put it away it sits right there and uh, along with that, these ones um, I also ordered, and I've used these quite a bit already. Um, these ones are the ticket stamps. Uh, let me see if I can get close to there. The ticket stamps. And there's a little bit of writing, and there's one with lots of tickets. So I love these. I've used these quite a bit already. Um... I've been uh, wanting to do this video and just haven't gotten to it. And then these ones are, these are like the wooden planks. And this one just has, um, okay, so it goes this way. 
has like some stamping on it and some writing and this one has some writing so there's three stamps on here and they are really nice for like you know uh, doing mixed media and things like that I love using these so yeah check out AliExpress for all kinds of stamps and then um, I got this one um, this one's my latest one that I got and it says um, friendship isn't a big thing it's a million million small friendship isn't a big thing it's a million little things and then um, <laughs> this one here says I'm willing to risk the cooties if you are <laughs> so that is kind of fitting for this uh, time that we're in but I mean I ordered that way before that this pandemic even started and there this one says there's nothing better than a friend unless it's a friend with chocolate hmm yeah that's right and uh, then I have a few more these are like vintage uh, stamps this vintage lady and the dress form and a little pin cushion and some scissors and pins and things like that and then I have one that I have used a little bit already it is this one and I will show you how this one turned out um, I believe it is this one yes it's in this journal um, I stamped her out and I didn't color her or anything I just stamped her out and I left it like that so it's not necessary Cyril it's not necessary to color your stamps like I did this in a dark green so it looks pretty good and then she had an umbrella that I did in a brown um, actually I thought think that's from a different stamp yeah the umbrella is from a different stamp so and this one says ladies fashion and then it has little earrings and some twine and a bow there and a little corset there so yeah I was doing a little vintage journal here and I thought it would go nicely in here and where do I put this one right in here so that's that one and then I want to show you these cute cute little uh, things here this is a little uh, purse die cut this right here makes this little purse um, it does the uh, little tag um, this tag and it even has the word hey so it is so cool and it has um let me put that one right there it has the little handles it has the little uh closure here so that you can close it it's just and it has the corners and yeah it makes a cute little purse you can easily put like um a little gift card in here for someone um you know a little gift card or something like that a little trinket in there uh, since Christmas is coming up so I thought that was cute and you know all the little details uh, I thought it would be bigger but it's not so yeah but it's a, it's very cute I think it was only like three dollars so that's not bad then on the other side here I have this little guy and when I ordered this I was looking at it it would be a little it would be a suitcase I assumed it would be you know like maybe that size but I punched it out this is what it is I punched it out here's the little handles and all that and it turned out to be this small <laughs> I mean it is adorable but what a lot of work like it has a little buckle there and everything 
it is really cute but I was hoping hoping it would be a little bigger I didn't make it so I could open it I'm just like yeah that's just too much so and this is and it has the little you know the little uh, buckles there and everything I just yeah what they can come up with I mean there's more things you could add to it it has these little hearts um these are this is the um I don't even know what that is but anyway it's one of the handles I think and this is the little uh uh, what do you call it the little tag and there's the airplane and this is the one that goes in the corners there and I don't even know what this was looks like a big stamp I don't even know where if that belongs to this set I have no idea and there's the little uh, buckle that goes around so yeah that was quite interesting <laughs> to die cut that. So I just kind of have kept these two together here. I thought I would show you. Quite interesting. Um, yeah, read the descriptions. Read the um, comments when you buy stuff. Even this little heart tag was in there. And yeah, all of this, the heart was in there. And... Yeah, if you're into these tiny little miniature things, that's the thing to buy. So, yeah. And then I bought these uh, die cuts. And I really, really like them. I will show you how they die cut if I can find them. And where are you? Okay, I have them in here. I have them close by because I've been using them quite a bit and um, I've just kept them together so when I die cut I want one I just do them all and that's why I have so many here and this is the blank one you get three blank ones and that's actually a bigger one and here's like the eight and here is the two and the three and another eight <coughs> excuse me <coughs> and I don't have the do I have the bigger one cut out no I don't think so <clears throat> but I think the bigger one is to um, to line the smaller ones like that excuse me I have to have a little sip here <clears throat> Yeah, so these are really nice to add to tags. Say you want to put a date on them, like <clears throat> 2020, like that. And, uh, yeah, it, you know, just have them at the ready. And um, they're so easy to just glue on. And, yeah, I have them in my little thing here that I'm messing up. But anyway, that's that. And then I have one last item here to show you. And it is this little uh, book. And it's called, it says Rebecca. So I don't know if they're all like that. I haven't even looked at it. Oh, it just, yeah, it has all kinds of pages in here. I guess it is Rebecca because that one has one. I'll have to send this to somebody named the Rebecca. That is so cool. I have not really even looked at this. So I guess it kind of repeats. Okay. Very cute. I'll have to see if they have Tina. <laughs> yeah. All right. That is my haul for you. I hope you have enjoyed it. Um, I hope... I give you some useful information when you order stuff. Um, I always like it when people give reviews on if they liked it or not because I never know uh, 
you know, if I'm going to like it or not, like this. I don't even know why I ordered it. I have stainless steel pots and pans, and it said it was great for stainless steel, so I thought it would be, like, you know, at least something you can hold in your hand while you're washing your pots and pans, but maybe you're supposed to put this on like this and then wash. I don't know. I'm going to try it, and if I don't like it, well, then I just won't use it. So that's my haul. Let me know what you like best. And uh, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. And yeah, we'll talk to you later. Bye.